so here as you can see with the same working principle we have here u11-2 okay so u11 as you can see here we have the calistoga this is the gmch okay also it contains many controls the same as the processor as you can see we have as you can see here we have here the direct media interface controller this is the control that connects between the GMC hints and the ICH as we have seen before and here we have the clock as you can see this is the clock part okay for those we have here NC means not connected or not used that's why we have this here okay so we have here MIECPM okay so CFG okay and DDR maxing etc here of course we have the third part where we have the LVDS this is for the monitor or the screen okay we have here TV we have here Vigia okay as you can see for the video graphic here we have as you see PSI Express graphics okay all those are controls and of course if you see here over here we have plus one point plus 1.5 volts this is one of the voltages that is applied to gmch okay also we will find 1.8 volt also okay here also we have plus 1.5 volts okay here we have here the part one of the gmch as you can see here for host okay so over here we have as you can see here the plus vccp the power plus vccp so the gmch has many kind of power so the plus vccp that equal to 1.05 volt also 1.5 volt and also 1.88 volt because the gmch contain the ram controller and always when you have a ddr to ram that is powered with 1.8 volt the gmch also or the ram control in the gmch will be powered by by 1.8 volts the same if you have for example a ram a ddr4 ram for example that is powered with 1.2 volt you will find also that the, the GMCH is powered also with 1.2 volt. Why? Because it contains the RAM controller or the random access memory controller. Okay. So here, as you can see, this is also the fourth part of GMCH where we have the DDR system memory, as you see, A. And here we have DDR system memory B. All those are controller. Here, this is the five or the fifth part okay so also as you can see here this is the power for the gmch as you can see here we have plus vccp as you can see okay so here this part is where the gmch is powered all these pins as you can see here is the power for the gmch so for the gmch it has many powers as I told you before so we have here plus or mini voltages as mm -hmm. I told you before so we have here plus VCCP that is equal to 1.05 volts okay so let's see we have here 2.5 volts we have 1.5 volts okay so we have here 1.5 volts as you can see is passed through a coil and through capacitors always when you find coil with capacitors means filtering okay and then goes here to the spin okay so here as you can see this is the gmch ground okay all these pins of the gmch is connected to the ground as you can see here also for those okay so the voltage for the gmch is plus vccp 1.05 volt 2.5 volt 1.5 volt and 1.8 volt as you can see here plus 1.8 volt as i have told you before this voltage is for the ram random access memory 
and also for the GMCH as you can see the name of the GMCH Calistoga okay 1.8 volts